Constellations by Captain Studybot. What are constellations? A constellation is simply defined as a recognizable group of conspicuous stars that are placed together as imaginary patterns or outlines on the celestial sphere. How many constellations are there? There are 88 modern constellations which were recognized by the International Astronomical Union IAU in 1922. The Celestial Sphere Ancient astronomers imagined the night sky as a giant sphere of stars rotating around the Earth. The idea of celestial sphere is still used to describe a star's position. Asterisms An asterism is a pattern of stars recognized in the Earth's night sky and may or may not be part of an official constellation. The picture on the left is an asterism whereas the picture on the right is a constellation. Are stars actually in pattern? The stars within an asterism really have any substantial astrophysical relationship to each other and their apparent proximity when viewed from Earth, disguises the fact that they are far apart, some being much farther than Earth, farther from Earth than others. The word constellation. The word constellation seems to have come from the late Latin term constellatio, which can be translated as set of stars and came into use in English during the 14th century. Brief History of Constellations In 2000 BCE, the first constellations are devised by Sumerians and Babylonians. 150 BC, Greek astronomer Ptolemy lists 48 constellations. 1596-1603, to 12 constellations are introduced by Dutch navigators. 1697 new constellations complete the northern sky. 1754 14 constellations are introduced by French astronomers to complete the southern sky. 1922 the 88 constellation patterns are sanctioned by the International Astronomical Union. Nineteen thirty, the constellations boundaries are agreed. 
these are some of the Chinese constellations. And those are Islamic constellations. The first constellations. The earliest direct evidence for the constellations come from inscribed stones and clay writing tablets dug up in Mesopotamia within modern Iraq dating back to 3000 BCE. These are some Babylonian or Mesopotamian constellations. The Greek constellations. This is a picture of Ptolemy. Claudius Ptolemy was a mathematician, astronomer, geographer, astrologer, and poet of a single epigram in the Greek anthology. He lived in the city of Alexandria in the Roman province of Egypt. Most of the constellations of the modern of the northern hemisphere derive from Greek astronomy as are the names of many stars, asteroids and planets. It was influenced by Egyptian and especially Babylonian astronomy. In turn it influenced Indian, Arabic, Islamic and Western European astronomy. Uses of constellations. The first use of constellations was probably religious and they named the constellations after their mythological heroes and legends. Before there were proper calendars, people had no way determining when to sow or harvest except by the stars. Constellations made patterns of the stars easy to remember. The constellations also helped with navigation. Dark Cloud Constellations The Great Rift, a series of dark patches in the Milky Way, is more visible and striking in the Southern Hemisphere than in the Northern Hemisphere. Some cultures have discerned shapes in these pat patches and have given names to these dark cloud constellations. The Australian Abor Aboriginal 
astronomy also describes dark cloud constellations and most famous being the emu in the sky whose head is formed by the coal sack dark nebula instead of stars these are the names of the 88 modern constellations this is the constellation andromeda and this is boots this is the traco and that it was hydra this is the pegasus and those are indus and pavo that is persis and sculptor it is also major and virgo constellations and astronomy astronomy is a natural science that studies celestial objects and phenomena constellations help astronomers determine the position of stars Astronomy is the oldest of the natural sciences. The early civilizations in recorded history such as uh, Babylonians, Greeks, Indians, Egyptians, Nubians, Iranians, Chinese and the Maya performed method methodical observations of the night sky. constellations and astronomy astrology astrology is the study of movements and relative position of celestial objects as mean of divining information about human affairs and terrestrial events astronomy is widely connected to the constellations especially the 13 zodiacs the 13 zodiacs are as follows stargazing 
we all enjoy looking up at the starry night sky especially on a clear moonless night away from bright lights anyone can learn about stars as a hobby all you will need are books of star books of star charts and maps so that you can recognize the various constellations and stars and their positions conclusion constellations have been part of human life for thousands of years but today we are not being able to view these celestial wonders due to pollution and night light from the cities therefore it is necessary that we keep our atmosphere clean have a happy stargazing and thank you credits this presentation was made by me captain study pot and uh, the following sites have been used for taking the information thank you for watching please like and subscribe Thank <laughs> you.